Hi there, my name's Andy Hillier, and today's guitar lesson is going to be on Black Creek by Brent Cobb. It's a cool track. Um, it came in as one of my requests on one of my other videos. Uh, so thanks for the request, whoever requested it. It's a beautiful song, relatively easy to play if you can do a bit of finger picking. So I'm going to teach you the whole song, but just before I do, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video. Um, leave me some comments in the comment section, let me know what songs you want me to do next. And if you love what I'm doing, you want to support me, support the channel, keep me going, and you want to print the tabs off for this, then I'll put them on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. My guitar is in standard tuning. Um, we've got three lines that we need to learn. We've got a verse, we've got a chorus, and then there's a little bit that goes after the chorus, which just kind of brings it back into the verse. Uh, and it's all repeated around that. Okay, so the verse sounds like this. So to play that, starting off with the D minor chord. First finger, E1. Third finger, B3. Second finger on G2. So D minor chord. And we're gonna play the D string, then the G, then the E. So you got. Then your thumb goes up a string to the A string, and you play A, then the B, then the G, and then the E. So from the beginning, slowly, you've got. And then we're gonna play the D string, then B, then G, and then E. So from the beginning, slowly, you've got. And then you play the A string, and then the B, and then the G. So slowly, the whole of bar one goes. A bit faster. So that's bar one. Then we've got an F chord. First finger barred across all the strings at the first fret. Second finger on G2, third finger A3, little finger on D3, so an F chord, holding that down. And we're gonna play the E string nearest to your face with your thumb, and then G, and then the E string nearest to the floor. So you got. And then your thumb goes down and plays the A3, then the B, the G, and then the E. So the first two beats of bar two goes. And then you play the E string nearest to your face, then the B, the G, and then the E nearest to the floor. So again, from the start of bar two, you got. And then you're gonna play the A string, and then B, and then G. So the whole of bar two slowly goes. A bit faster. So let's just put bars one and two together. You got. Into bar three and we've got a C chord which is your first finger on B1, second finger D2, third finger A3. And we're gonna play the A3 with the thumb and then playing G, and then the E nearest to the floor. And then you've gotta move your third finger up a string to E3, and then the B1, the G, and then the E. So slowly you've got You have to move your third finger from the A string to the E string. Then it goes back to your third finger on A3, B1, G, and E. So again, from the beginning of bar three, you got. And then we get this little trill, 
which is a hammer on from open D to D2 and then pull off. And then play open G and then B1. So you get. So the whole of bar three. And then bar four, we've got this. So for that, we've got the D minor chord again, and you're gonna play the D, the G2, the E1, and then B3, the open D, and then G2. So shall you got. Then use your little finger on E3, pull off to the E1, then G2, and then E1 again, so from the beginning of the bar you got. Then play the B3, the G2, and then the E1. So bar four. Okay, so let's try the whole line slowly, here we go. faster. So that's the verse and that repeats round and then we get a chorus and the chorus sounds like this. So for that we'll get the F chord and we're going to play the E1 nearest to your face, the G2, the E1 nearest to the floor, then A3, the B1, the G2 and then the E1 nearest to the floor. So you get. Then it jumps to a C chord and you're playing the A3, the open G, the E nearest to the floor. Move your third finger up and play a, uh, sorry, E3 nearest to your face, then B1, then G, and then E. So bar number five slowly goes. So two beats on F, two beats on C. Uh, and then bar six, uh, we've got a G chord and we've got So for that, Little finger E3, third finger B3, second finger on E3 nearest to your face, and first finger, it's gonna go on A2, it'll do a hammer on on that. So we play the E3, the open G, E3 nearest to the floor, then open A string, and hammer on to A2 with the first finger, then play the open G, the uh, B3, so you got this. Then E3, then B3, then D, and then the B3 again. And then that same hammer on, open A to A2, then open G, and then open B. So slowly that bar goes. A bit faster. Uh, then we go back to the F chord, it's playing like we did at the beginning. So play E1, then G2, E1 nearest to the floor, A3, B1, and then G2. So you go. Then to a C chord, and play A3, open G, and then open E. A little hammer on from D to D2, back to D. And there's just a, a B string at the end there, so you get. Uh, 
And then that last bar is the same as the last bar um, in the verse, so the D minor. So let's try the whole of that line, the chorus, uh, slowly. Here we go. faster. And that repeats, and then after the first chorus, um, we go, actually it does it both times actually, after the chorus it goes to this next line, which is basically playing uh, the same as bars two, three and four of the verse. So you've got F, C, and then the D minor. So you just get this. So it's just three bars that go um, at the end of the chorus, and then it will go back to the verse, play the verse around, play the chorus around, uh, and then play this line again. And then it just does the chorus, um, I think, till the end of the song. Well, I do hope you've enjoyed that little guitar lesson. If you have, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier. It really does help, uh, as does giving me a like on the video. And the more comments, the better. If you just want to say hi, say hi. Let me know where in the world you're from. Uh, and more importantly, let, let me know what songs I should do next. And if you love what I'm doing, you want to support me, support the channel, and you want to print the tabs off for this, then I'll put them on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. Well, thanks for watching this. I do appreciate it. I've been Andy Hillier, and I'll see you next time. Music